Ooh, battlefield doctor. Hello guys, it's me again. <laughs> the battlefield doctor. And guys, well, how has been your week? So, well, um, this video is getting published on Sunday. Uh, but I'm recording this actually on Wednesday, June 21st. But well, you are used to it. <laughs> And well, I just want to talk to you about the last Sunday and well, as you can see, I'm seeming to be more brown than before and I'm having a red nose and it's not because I was uh, drinking alcohol or so, I had no alcohol for some weeks. Um, well, it's actually well burn from the sun and well, you should look there on my neck, it's <laughs> awful. So, well, on uh, last Sunday, I've been to a classic car meeting. It was really an amazing uh, meeting. Uh, I was there with my Audi 80 and, uh, well, took me some time to drive over there. I'm thinking it was like uh, one and a half hour. And uh, the meeting was actually bigger than I've expected. Because uh, before, earlier, I have only known about uh, some videos of that and uh, these videos were shorter and uh, so I didn't know that there's so much more and the weather it was just uh, sunshine no cloud and really very warm <laughs> warmer than expected as well so I was getting a nice sunburn <laughs> if you can say it's nice <laughs> Um, yeah, and the cool thing, or actually was it cool, I mean, there was uh, something at the end uh, of that uh, meeting, so I was there for quite a long time, I think for six hours or so, and well, I also had to do some uh, breaks to drink some water. I couldn't drink uh, silent water at the event itself because, uh, well, uh, they only sold the... Um, sparkling table water and it was uh, just the classic as we are saying in German in Germany and it was just uh, well the with much the much fizzy uh, sparkling table water and I actually shouldn't drink that um, but uh, well my stomach survived it without any issues so I'm in good hope that uh, I'm good in recovery so and well I'm also still eating uh, the stuff that I can eat and not other things so until now it's uh, all right even at work I mean right now uh, today was a more busy day and also my colleague uh, was not at work today and will not be at work uh, for the rest of the week um, but yeah, I managed it I just told myself well, calm down when there was anything uh, when I was just a little bit too stressed about it and well it worked most of the times. <laughs> but well, my stomach is alright, so that's something good. Um, <clears throat> but uh, well, about, it's kind of windy, huh? Uh, about the classic car meeting. So, so guys, um, <laughs> hi. <laughs> I'm crazy sometimes. Um, yeah. So uh, at the classic car meeting, at the end, uh, when I wanted to go back to my car, and it, uh, the area was uh, bigger than I've expected, so well, I wasn't able to drink my silent water that was in my car because it was just too far away, and so I decided to do that at the end. But no problem about that. Uh, don't I don't want to talk actually about the water. <laughs> I want to talk about uh, one weird experience there, and it was uh, when I've been there. Uh, walking down and suddenly I was seeing uh, a yellow Audi 80 like mine driving out uh, of a parking lot there oh, well is it called parking lot I mean it was just on, on, on the grass and it was just a park it was parking beside another one and so I was just wondering I was just thinking uh, hello why is my car moving <laughs> But, but well, uh, when it turned uh, down downhill, uh, then I've noticed uh, that it's not my car because it was another Audi 80 than mine. Uh, just uh, the color was very similar to mine. 
and it was the facelift so at the uh, rear end i was seeing okay all right huh it's not my car but well you can guess if you're seeing your car just driving away then it's like uh and well there are usually not as many audi 80s on uh, such events so i'm also most likely the only one or maybe sometimes there are one or two others and but but seeing one also in a very similar color like mine that was absolutely random absolutely random but well just showing showing you some uh, pictures i've also uploaded uh, this short on my other channel uh, so uh, well but here now for you guys also in this video here Audi 80 B2 pre facelift with the 75 horsepower engine and here we have something more five cylinder modified this is the facelift just running around because this should be a YouTube short So see this guys, facelift and pre-facelift. The guy was also placing his car in front of mine and we opened our hood and everything. And it turned out that the guy also uh, had the same engine uh, as I in his uh, Audi 80. So uh, he had the, well our engine code is uh, w v slash uh, y n and the difference between the w v that's what is in my car is uh, and the uh, y n is only the carburetor it are two different uh, pierberg uh, carburetors and that's the actual uh, difference between y n and uh, w v the engine itself is the same so we both have the same engine or actually had because well he was doing some modification as I uh, mentioned in that uh, clip and uh, he did put in his uh, car a, an engine from an Audi 80 B4 so just uh, two generations later and uh, a five cylinder with an amazing sound took him 300 hours to do that he's a car mechanic so he can do that or actually he could do the most stuff um, yeah but it was, it was really interesting to meet someone about this uh, who was also telling so much about his hobby and his Audi and uh, well we were seeing the same color and uh, first I was thinking that my car was just uh, maybe being too much in the sun but my car is only two years uh, older than his one <laughs> and we figured out that uh, we have different colors on our cars and uh, my car is in Pasadena yellow and his car is in mango yellow so mango is more yellowish and the uh, Pasadena yellow is more well more creamish or something like that I don't know well you can see it I can also include the other clips that I've made there when I was just uh, arriving there and uh, walking around uh, when both cars were standing uh, just right next to each other well I'm just doing that now because so I will have a nice video for you guys as well. Just showing you there, just beside me. <laughs> but it's the facelift one. And guys, here's my Audi AD B2. And left beside is the other one, the facelift. And you can see the difference here just side by side. So I'm having this uh, chrome bar there and my, and there it's not. And the facelift has these, um, well, more aerodynamic, these uh, headlights. Just trying to show you a little bit easier. Maybe you can see it. And the different tail lamps like as from the Audi 100 but these are a little bit different and you can open the trunk a lid here also up to there while mine is uh,
just opening into there. So perfect example about facelift and pre-facelift. And well, the entire classic car meeting, this will be something that I will publish on my other channel. Um, if you have not yet subscribed here, well, here's the name, uh, BFD Drives. I will also link it into the uh, info thingy here. And um, so um, I'm going to publish uh, the complete video about everything what I was seeing there uh, on the other channel. But um, I have also to mention that uh, that it will take quite a while because right now I'm still editing on the last Kasi car meeting uh, from April and uh, so there are many parts because I'm always splitting these videos in uh, parts of uh, 10 minutes and so this will take a while but well so now you have seen this and I hope you like it <laughs> but well guys anyway see you in my next video bye bye